Rafael Nadal is the king of tennis, and he owns a luxurious lifestyle. His luxurious lifestyle includes his luxurious watch collection. He is a tennis player who is well known for wearing expensive watches during his matches. All the watches he wore are of Richard Mill, and their worth is very high. All the watches are designed especially for the player, and each watch has some unique characteristics. Rafael Nadal has won many of his Grand Slam titles while wearing these expensive watches. Rafael Nadal is in partnership with Richard Mill for 22 years now. In this video, we'll talk about the most expensive watch Rafael Nadal. We'll also be sharing the unique attributes of these watches and we'll tell you when Rafael Nadal was seen wearing these timepieces. Before we move forward, don't forget to subscribe to the channel and press the bell icon so you don't miss any updates. Rafael Nadal and Richard Mill Contract In 2008, Rafael Nadal met Richard Mill for the first time. It was the time he refused to wear a watch. He could have never thought of wearing a watch in court. Rafael Nadal was very reluctant and Richard Mill was very convincing. They somehow ended up developing the lightest turbolon in the world at the time. Rafael Nadal explained the beginning of their contract. He said, Richard came to my house and showed me a model, telling me, this is the watch we made for you. The watch was made of platinum and was very heavy. I was confused and didn't realize he was joking. I fell in love with the real watch the moment I put it on. We were on the same frequency. For me, the watch has become like a second skin. According to reports, Nadal broke six watches when he first began testing prototypes for Richard Mill in 2010. The relationship between Rafael Nadal and Richard is, however, more than just a partnership. Rafael Nadal has expressed that Richard is a very positive person. He also said, He is a person who wants to boost the watchmaking industry forward rather than simply sit back and enjoy his success. He strives for excellence, which I admire. Like in tennis, I always strive to improve and work hard to do so. Richard Mill says, Rafa and I have a lifelong commitment. We are there come rain or shine. It was more than just watchmaking, it is life. RM2704 Ever since the partnership of Rafael Nadal and Richard Mill has come into existence, the Swiss watchmaker has issued numerous references for Rafael Nadal's owner. No one can forget the latest timepiece, RM2704 also called. The wrist candy was launched in September 2020. It was launched in honor of the 10th anniversary of the spectacular partnership between the innovative Swiss watch brand and the Spanish tennis star. Uniqueness of the timepiece it is designed the way the tennis racket gets strong. The mechanism of this watch is fully supported by a micro-blasted mesh measuring 855 square millimeters. It comprises a single braided steel cable which measures nearly 0.27 millimeters in diameter. The steel cable is attached to a turnbuckle at the position of 5 o'clock. It is then woven above and below the main strings to form cross strings. The cable passes through the hollow grade 5 titanium flange 38 times before coming to an end at another turnbuckle at 10 o'clock. The movement in the watch is positioned diagonally. Five grade 5 polished titanium hooks coated with red gold PVD extend from the back of the base plate and connect it to the mesh. The vibration dampeners have been added to the turbulon chatons, the barrel, and the hands around the 6 o'clock position, just as players add dampeners to their strings. Just like other Nadal-dedicated watches of Richard Mill, RM2704 is also very light in weight. Including the strap, it weighs 30 grams. This timepiece offers a tremendous level of shock resistance. Rafael Nadal wearing RM2704 In 2020, Rafael Nadal won his 13th French Open title and his 20th Grand Slam title. In these matches, he played against Roger Federer and Novak Djokovic. Rafael Nadal was wearing his RM2704 in these matches. After that, during his win at the Australian Open in 2022, Nadal was seen wearing the same watch. Right now, the popular assumption is that the world-famous athlete was donning this watch as a lucky charm in his Australian Open 2022. Price of the watch Now, let's tell you the price of this watch. You can get this watch exclusively at Richard Mill Boutiques worldwide for $1 million. Only 50 pieces of this watch were made. RM2703 It is a limited series of 50 timepieces. It retails for a casual $725,000.
The design of this watch may not be for everyone, but Richard Mill deserves credit for creating a pretty cool and highly functional tourbillon movement that can withstand such a force. In the amazing collection of Rafael Nadal watches, RM2703 is no exception. So what is different about this watch? Well, the watch's design alludes to the French tennis champion's strong personality. The RM2703 combines cutting-edge materials with a sophisticated watchmaking architecture. The RM2703, with its striking red and yellow quartz case that pays homage to Rafa's native Spain, is known for its amplifying effect on clay quartz. This intense burst of color is achieved by impregnating fine layers of silica only 45 microns thick with a tinted matrix using a propriety swish process that stacks the filaments in layers before heating them to 120 degrees centigrade. The extraordinary characteristics of this watch is that it can withstand shocks up to 10,000 grams. Hand-polished, tapered anglage and graceful satin brush surfaces that highlight the sparkle of finely microblasted elements are among the magnificent finishes that adorn the RM2703 caliber. The RM2703 has an impressive volume play. Rafael Nadal wearing this watch Rafael Nadal 2017 won the US Open wearing this watch. RM2702 Next on the list of most expensive watches, Rafael Nadal is RM2702. The worth of this watch is close to $800,000. This watch can withstand forces up to 5,000 Gs. Why is the price of this watch so high? Because it is manufactured to exacting standards for a professional athlete to wear while playing. Not just any professional athlete, but one who plays the game like he's a Tasmanian devil on fire. It also undergoes extensive research and development. The unibody base plate, major watchmaking and technological breakthrough machined at ProArt is a technical feat that requires in-depth knowledge and mastery of micro-machining new materials, a concept that Richard Mill has nurtured since the beginning. The sculptural base plate supports the bridges in Grade 5 titanium, which are highly original in terms of their three-dimensional construction. Finishes, hand-beveled, shot-blasted and satin-brushed, and titanium and carbon composition. These bridges support an impressive mechanical heart that can run for over 70 hours without losing its regularity thanks to a rapidly rotating barrel that delivers constant power from start to finish. Richard about RM2702 We have a limited supply, said Mill according to Forbes. When you divide all of these developments by the number of pieces we manufacture, you get a very high cost. And this is why we are known as the Formula One of the watch industry, because the situation is the same. You develop all the time and only release a few units. But this is what we enjoy. RM2701 In 2001, Richard Mill created the first watch in the collection of Torbalon RM001. It was available for sale in 2013. It is the last one on the list in this video. The brand wanted to break the world record for the lightest mechanical watch once and for all with this watch. The RM2701 is an exceptional creation that takes the concepts of lightness and strength to their logical conclusion. The record was broken in 2013 when this watch weighed exactly 18.83 grams, including the heaviest part, the strap. This was a huge task. The Caliber RM2701 is an engineering and technological triumph. Richard Mill's determination to create a movement held in total suspension in the heart of its case resulted in its complex, original architecture. Richard Mill was inspired by suspended civil engineering infrastructures and wanted to adopt these modes of construction to the watchmaking sphere, occupying only a few tens of millimeters. Richard Mill's movement engineers gave tangible form to this avant-garde concept after many months of development firmly establishing it as one of the most innovative architectural constructions of recent years. This was all from the video. Hope you all liked it. What are your views about these expensive watches of Rafael Nadal? Also, share your views on whether spending this amount of money on watches is worth it. We would love to hear your thoughts in the comment section.